we've been away for a little bit. At least I've been away for a little bit, so we haven't been able to do our regular weekly conversations. But uh, I, I scratched my itch a little bit yesterday. I invited J2K on for a live show. But, yeah, man, I'm excited. I'm excited to talk to you again. David, how you doing, man? Long time. Good, man. Dude, like, I, I in case anybody ever thought that we were uh, done, and my wife said that, you know, maybe people think that we're done because the last video we posted was uh, how much this team sucks and how much Ryan Bull <laughs> sucks. So and then just like maybe and then just silence <laughs> for two weeks and everybody. And she was like, I hope people fuck don't this. think you guys just said fuck this shit and like logged out. Um, One more viral short of me just like breaking the computer and right there and then it's and done. That's the end of Bearski film. Um, uh, no, nope. we are so much more scarred. As Bears fans, at this point, I kind of enjoy the wounds <laughs> to an extent. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah. Foster, it's... dude, love Foster, man. Uh, if Foster's still kicking hello. and going as a Bears fan, I think we can make it too, right? So, yeah. I love <laughs> Remember Foster. Remember what he told still. us? He's like, oh, you wouldn't have survived through the 70s. No. This fucking team. So, yeah. I mean, no, ups but and downs I'm and good, dude. Um, I will say I'm, I'm really glad you're back because I have been uh, – basically like divvying up my bears opinions to like four different people. That's how much we bother each other about bears football opinions is that like, I've had to kind of like text one friend and then one friend and then one friend and then one friend <laughs> just with like enough football opinions to kind of disperse how much I would normally text you about everything bears. So I'm really glad yeah. you're back. And I'm sure those people are glad you're back too. So I don't Whereas bother them anymore about football. I've been the opposite, man. I've been left to nothing but my own thoughts. I mean, other than streaming the game and watching it and paying attention as much as I could, I, I was off the grid during vacation. I wasn't on Twitter. I wasn't on, you know what I mean? So it was just me and my own thoughts, and that can be a very dangerous thing sometimes. <laughs> so while, while you were off, you know, relaxing and getting away from football, people like me stuck here in the fucking trenches are still, <laughs> are still fucking pissed off, and you're all like, Hey man, football's like not that important anymore, man. And I'm like, it's like it's just one part of life, and we're doing just fine. And I'm like, no, no, this shit sucks, and we should be pissed off. But no, I was. Yeah, I, you know, you do get away from that um, compulsive obsession <laughs> you have. However, believe me, man. The second I saw a guy with a bear's hat, I was like, oh, I got to go talk to that guy. Yeah. Like, yeah, well, ooh, wait, wait. Ooh, ooh, bear's hat? Ooh, Do I see a bear's hat? <laughs> you can't, I can't help it, man. It's just, it's just is what it is. And like, you walk up to him, you're like, bears. <laughs> they know. They know. You know what I mean? <laughs> That's so funny that you say that because I was like literally at the store and I just had this shirt on and some guy just went, bears. Bears. I went, bears. Bears.